Now, what's going to be the major product in this reaction? We have an alkene, and we are trying to react it with methanol, which is neither a good base, nor it's a good acid, nor it's a good nucleophile. But we have the tazilic acid here as the catalyst. So as my step number one, I'm going to protonate my alkene using the tazilic acid like so, giving me two possible carbocationic intermediates. The one on the left, that is a tertiary carbocation, and the one on the right, technically that would be a primary carbocation because we are only connected to one other carbon. Now, for any reaction in organic chemistry, whenever we have carbocations, we always want to form the most stable carbocation possible. Is there anything more stable than a tertiary carbocation? And actually, yes, there is. In this case, our carbocation on the right side is stabilized by the resonance. So it's not actually a primary carbocation, but rather that is a resonance-stabilized carbocation, which means that we are going to go with this carbocation and not with the tertiary one, because the one on the right is more stable. Now, once we know which carbocation we are going to be using in this case, we are going to bring our methanol, which is going to serve as our nucleophile, attack our electrophilic position, which is our carbocation, so we can show it with a minor resonance contributor, or, if you like, you could also show it with a major resonance contributor, like so, giving us the following protonated intermediate, which we are going to neutralize by using another equivalent of our methanol to pull that proton off, giving us the following final product. So always remember to check for resonance for your carbocations, Otherwise, you can miss the correct answer.